Well, it's morning of day three, and we're going to get started before sunrise, or at least get going, uh, get our stuff together before sunrise. Didn't get a lot of sleep last night because of that sign that talked about bear activity. <laughs> I kept thinking about it all night, uh, but I've got about 10 miles a day. It's going to be a tough climb. We'll see what happens. I'm going to get the guys up, and we're going to get some coffee and then we'll get started it's our last day in the smokies we got everybody up early our campmates whoever they were they left as we were getting up they were packed out and ready to go never heard them never heard a peek at them so we got big fist lookout and we never came up with a name i guess he will be no name so we've got breakfast going and we're about to pack up and head out and I think we've got about 10 miles today, maybe nine and a half. We're not exactly sure. Maybe 24. Maybe 24. See, Lookout's got my mentality for YouTube. You just lie and say you did a lot more miles than you did. So this morning as we're walking, I was gonna tell you about last night. There was, we were thinking about these bears because there's a sign that says bears in the area, you know, don't leave food out and all this stuff. So I was kind of on high alert thinking there would be a bear somewhere in my camp. So as, as the lights went out, the sun went down, got in my tent and I started smelling something thinking, that's a bear. That's a bear, it smells, you know, kind of foresty, animal-like. And then I realized I had my mouth open and I was breathing in my nose and I was just smelling my breath. I closed my mouth and the smell went away. No bear, just bad breath. So it was close. I thought it was about a mile. And then we don't want to go to the ranger station. Where does that even go? Down there to the ranger station. And then we're going to the 20 mile trail and then we're going to get up to the, what was that other trail called? The Lost Cave Trail or something? Y'all are supposed to know. Sorry. Something Ridge. Lone Wolf Ridge? Or Lone Wolf Ridge, yeah. Wait, that's what... about it big fist you had a good trip yeah it's been great so far so far fantastic weather but may have just jinxed it so <laughs> i used it like 16 times great weather look out having a great time it's good stuff and we three uh, cub yeah so we've decided to hopefully we don't know if it'll stick but we're thinking about calling keegan here smoky smoky i like it because it's his first like two night backpacking trip in the Smokies and he saw, yeah, saw four bears. He saw four bears. That's amazing. Yeah. That's the first bear I've seen the wire wild and you see one of your first trip. <laughs>
a nice stream down here. Oh, yeah, that was awesome. Oh, wow. Here we go. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh sick. Oh, we got a bridge. I think some Smurfs live under here. Probably. Oh yeah, Dad, you need to get the hiker Smurf and put it under there. I didn't bring it. You, you didn't bring it? it? I didn't bring hiker Smurf. All right, we've done 2.9. We're coming up to the junction. We're, oh, wait. This is where we, this is, this is this is where we were yesterday. Dude, we yeah. This is where we were yesterday. And we were like, wait, do we know where the... So, there's the sign. 4.6. There no, it we is. Going that way. Oh, wait, we are going this way. That's where we oh, went yesterday. Yikes. And to, today we're going this way. <laughs> All right, 1.7 back to the AT. James Rodriguez. What? This is where y'all leave me. The dam. All right, <laughs> we'll see y'all somewhere back Good at Chuck's Stack. Situation when the when the soldiers are about to go into battle. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure what that was. All right, I've got 1.7 straight up climb back to get to the Appalachian Trail. We're coming up 20 mile trail. We were at a junction and I could tell, I'd forgotten what it was like the first day it would come down, but I'm definitely heading back up. Hope to get back up to the top here in a minute. And then it'll be a smooth ride down. So I was sitting down for a minute, taking a break, going up the 20 mile trail to get back to the AT. It's straight up. Just like every other trail we've done so far. Straight up, straight down. Boy, it's a good though, challenge. So I had to take a little break. I was just kind of pondering stuff, thinking about spiritual stuff. And I was kind of like, oh, I'm just so hot. And all of a sudden there's this beautiful breeze just came flowing through the trees and just cooled me off. It was awesome. All right, I finally made it up to the sign. I'm back on the AT, but just barely. That 20 mile loop trail, no, the 20 mile trail, it kicked my tail. Anyway, I can show you where I came up. I mean, all that is just straight down. I was looking over here. There's a blaze on the AT if you can see it. I hope to see that in about seven years. I don't know, maybe not, but it sure would be nice. All right, let's go down to the dam, Fontana Dam, about 
and let's get a cheeseburger. Just what I was about to say. This is kind of a bad scenario. I'm heading downhill, monster straight down, 3.7 that we came up on the first day. And I'm about to say that I've told the younger guys, like, because they're going so fast, like, this is a great place to break an ankle. So please watch your foot placement. I'm uh, real careful. I have weak ankles anyway. I hope they're careful. But man, we got a view beautiful out here. I did it. Back to the Fontana Dam Road. There's the AT through hikers permit box. Made it back to the sign. Tough, tough climb and descent. Oh, made it to the road. That feels good. Well, this will about conclude this uh, three part series of the loop in the Smoky Mountains. I appreciate you guys for sticking in there with me. I wasn't uh, too good of a hiker, but I made it. Got to get back to the truck, find my, my son and his buddies who have just absolutely destroyed me on this trip. And we're going to go find a cheeseburger, some Gatorades, and maybe even a milkshake. I hadn't had a milkshake in years, but I may get one. All right, I'll see you guys next time on the next adventure of As the Crow Flies Hiking. Actually, that's fantastic.